Hello and welcome to another Mac question tutorial. Uh, I do apologize for not making a video for such a long time. I had exams at college, so I, you know, I had to take some time out from this kind of stuff. Now, um, just today, I was going through the website, you know, researching on how do I view HDRI images um, in Windows Explorer, like, as in thumbnails. And uh, I actually figured out, how, uh, you know, I found a program on how to do it, and uh, it lets you view the HDR, which is proof is right here, um, images. Uh, as thumbnails, so it saves it saves me a lot of time, obviously, because I have to open up these other third-party uh, programs and you know navigate to uh, to you know to the HDR images, open them up, have a look at you know what one which one is which, and then uh, throughout there, that's how I used to view my HDR images. Okay, so but simply with this, I can just open them up and have a look, but. <clears throat> by installing this plugin or whatever you want to call it, um, you can straight away view the mess thumbnail, save you a lot of time. It's really take a little time to load, but I guess we can live with that. It's better than you know opening up another program. Okay, so th this link is down below in the description. All you need to do is click on it, go on the website, and uh, then uh, the problem is the website is in Russian so if you have Google Chrome you just click the translate button and it will translate the website into English or if you prefer it in Russian please do go ahead feel free to uh, read it in Russian and uh, down here for the Windows files if you have a 32-bit system you know obviously down that one if you have a 64 down 64-bit version now this works and you know, I've tried it myself I'm showing you there and um, you know uh, I find it really useful it saves me a lot of time so all you need to do is click download and it will tell you where you want to download it, I want to save it on desktop, save and it takes about a minute to download and that's pretty much it go ahead and go through the installation, nothing else you need to do after that all you need to do is navigate to a folder which has HDR uh, I images when you open it up it will start loading like this, don't, don't right click on anything because uh, it will freeze for a while, I don't know why that happened but now if you right click you know it's fine but don't right click the first time when it's um, reading the thumbnails uh, um, and transforming the data. So now, yeah, and that's pretty much on how to uh, view th uh, thumbnails, um, oh, HDR images as thumbnails. And I uh, hope it helps you, it helps you save you time. And I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. And just before you go, don't forget to comment down below, rate my video, subscribe to my channel. I'll always be bringing you some new stuff to save you time and, uh, you know, make your life a lot easier. And yeah, all that kind of stuff. Good day.